This is Ryan Abraham for uscfootball.com, revisiting my three keys to victory for USC and Arizona. Of course, the Trojans defeat the Wildcats 43-41 in triple overtime here in the Coliseum. Sneak preview, they haven't hit any of my three keys for this one, but they did get the overtime win, triple overtime win. Lincoln Riley was happy after the game to escape this one. When you don't play your best and you're able to get a victory and go 6-0 on the season. My first key was I wanted to see USC push at the line of scrimmage and get six yards per carry. They didn't get there about four and a half or so by, by the end of the game. Uh, they had some good runs, but there was a lot of runs that were stuffed at the line. There were some sacks uh, by Caleb Williams, but didn't look like the offensive line played all that well. There were some penalties. Mason Murphy ended up having to come in and play a lot of right tackle, so didn't quite get the push uh, with the run game. They get some big runs, uh, to, and Caleb Williams ran for three touchdowns himself, but overall just wasn't the success in the run game you'd like to see. Uh, for three, for, for the second point, for my three, I wanted to see three Big defensive stops in the second half. USC didn't get any. Uh, so I wanted to see some three and outs, turnovers. Uh, they, you know, In the first half, they did okay. Second half, uh, kind of gave up a bunch of points to Arizona. So didn't really get any of those big defensive stops we were looking for. And that's why the game went into triple overtime. Although Lincoln Riley was pretty happy with his defense. And Caleb Williams defended the defense. And my last key was 22. I wanted to see USC win by three touchdowns and cover the spread for the first time in three weeks. They did not. Arizona's now 5-1 and one on the season against the spread. USC obviously squeaked out a two-point victory in triple overtime. So didn't hit any of the keys, but USC does go into the uh, halfway point of the season, 6-0. and oh. The toughest part of the schedule is coming up, going to Notre Dame next week. So we'll see how they do. But uh, that's my revisiting the three keys to victory for USC and Arizona. Make sure you check out uscfootball.com for more.